Well, if you're planning on spending any time outdoors today, you might want to take notice that the sky could be a little hazy, a little cloudy. That's because Air Environment Canada has issued an air quality alert. Yeah, Bill Coulter was just mentioning that. Let's check in with our Jamie Goodfriday. He's live this morning down at Ashbridge's Bay uh, along the beach there. It looks, it looks can be deceiving there because it looks kind of beautiful, but also there are concerns about the air quality, Jamie. Yeah, obviously, I mean, Environment Canada putting out the, the word, especially for those who are uh, deal with respiratory illnesses, uh, people who are pregnant, uh, if you're an outdoor worker, for instance, and you know, there might be uh, higher levels of air pollution. And that's why this air quality statement has been issued by Environment Canada. So it's something that we have to monitor uh, that could fluctuate off and on over the next uh, couple of days. Uh, right now, we're down here at Ashbridge's Bay. Uh, it's not too bad right here. It's a little bit cooler by the lake. It's nice and fresh. Uh, but it is getting quite gusty. So there are some recommendations uh, from Environment Canada. You might have to even bring out that N95 just to take precautions for some. Uh, and even small particles that can uh, seep in could be uh, dangerous to your health. So if you're experiencing shortness of breath, you're coughing, you're wheezing, you're having an asthma attack, it's probably a good idea to stay indoors. If you have one of those HEPA filters, uh, that's always a great idea just to, um, to lower the risk and make sure, uh, keep your keep your windows clean as well. Uh, avoid air purifiers that produce ozone. That's also some of the recommendations. And if you're just if you're feeling unwell, just uh, stay inside. But this is something that we're going to be monitoring uh, over the next couple of days as the air quality could be deteriorating at times. We'll send it back to you for now.